take a break I'll just keep on traveling home Driving down the lonely motorway Sun comes up on another day Imagining your tight but smiling face Not long now till I reach Just to take my time Cause you need me Safe at home I feel like this might be the slowest sock I've ever knitted But yesterday I put the heel line in See the purple line there so I'm trying to pick it up and do a couple of rounds every time I have five minutes. I've got eight minutes before I've got to go and get Cosmo and Ivy. Uh, Ivy strictly doesn't need to be fetched, but she's got a club after school today. So I'm going to pick her up after I've collected Cos. So I'm going to have a couple of minutes on this now before I have to go and get them. I've been busily tidying and cleaning Cosmo's room and dying yarn all day. <laughs> so there's not been anything particularly exciting to show there, um, other than obviously yarn dyeing is exciting, but it's such a mess. That's not true. It's not a mess. My dye studio is quite tidy, but it is um, very dye stained and well, what you'd expect a working environment to be like, really. So I don't like to show too much of that because it, you know, it's a bit embarrassing. But once I've reno once we've renovated it, I will definitely show you what it looks like when it's all brand new. <laughs> It hasn't been the most scintillating day, has it? But it's gone 10 o'clock and I've still not edited this video. So I'm going to do that very swiftly and then I'm going to wind up the first mini I need from this new pack. And I'm just going to wind it by hand this time because I didn't like them being caked last time. So I've wrapped all the presents and put them in the front of the fireplace, which is where we always put the presents. There's not a very large pile because Ivy usually has some spending money. And then on Saturday, we're going to Meadow Hall and she will go shopping and pick out nice things that she chooses herself. So that's so some, some money for her. But um, she's still got a couple of things to open and... Uh, She's looking forward to having a nice birthday tea. Her grandma's and her granddad are coming over for tea. And she's written me a menu. <laughs> so my first order of business tomorrow is um, food shopping. And I'll be up with the lark because she'll be wanting to open her things before before she goes to school. So uh, I shall say good night and I'll see you in the morning. Thanks very much for joining me. Bye.